the evidence is slowly beginning to build that Obsidian Entertainment might actually be working on another Fallout game. Oh, come on, PC. That's all speculation and rumor. Ah, but back at the beginning of the year, uh, Obsidian was scouting out New Orleans as a location for a potential upcoming game. Sure, that could be anything, you say. But a month later, the voice actor for Deacon in Fallout 4 confirmed that pre-production for potentially a Fallout 5, or at least a sequel to Fallout 4, was in the works. Of course, we all know that Bethesda Works pretty much starts on another game right after releasing one, so that's not that big of a deal either, right? But on April 1st, Leonard Boyarski, the original Fallout art director and Troika Games co-founder, changed his Facebook profile to the Brotherhood of Steel Armored Paladin from the game's box art. Of course, you could dismiss that as just an April Fool's joke, but a few days later he took a picture, posted a picture of himself and Tim Kane, another Troika member, showing them working together. And he then later changed his profile to show that he did in fact leave Blizzard after 10 years over there and is working for Obsidian. Now, of course, this could mean that they're working on Fallout New Orleans, codename, uh, or they could be working on Vampire the Masquerade 2, which we know that Obsidian is working on. So either one of those are a possibility. Share in the comments what you think, which game would you prefer to see, or maybe both, and what do you think of the possibilities that Obsidian is actually maybe working on another Fallout game.